Okay, guys, let me get my lighting right. I'm gonna I had to stop in and do this video because last couple clients I've had has dealt with their uh, previous employer sending them a bill well after they've been employed there for insurance coverage. And you guys, when we are dealing with uh, breaking up with a company, if you will, we got to make sure that we have all of our I's dotted and our T's crossed. So if you're switching, retiring, um, resigning, whatever the case may be, if you're settling, you want to make sure that that insurance policy that was in force, you know, and I'm talking about medical insurance, you guys, medical insurance. So know that if you do start at a new company or you're resigning or, or retiring, like I said, you want to make sure that you're not going to be stuck with a bill because they will bill you. And the bill, uh, oftentimes they're pretty large. So again, I've had a couple cases where I've, I've met with people, I've coached people, and they're shocked when they receive a bill. So make sure you're getting in touch with the payroll department, making sure that you are expressing, hey, I no longer need this coverage because they will stick it to you. All right. And I'm not saying all companies will do this. I'm just saying that it's just been too much of that happening lately. So I want to clarify what happens when you leave. Make sure that you tie up any loose ends. So I hope this helps someone out there. I'm Kristen Peoples of BossaCulture.org. Bye.